Good afternoon, this is Chris Brecher with the Simpler Stocks free video from March 27, 2017, the weekend edition. It's about 25 minutes after the close. Uh, today was all about the ESs getting whipped around by any kind of news coming out out of Capitol Hill. By the end of the day, ES is up 475. NASDAQ up 2475, Russell up 470. Uh, 460, I'm sorry. You had the bonds up fractionally. Industrials down about 60, led by the banks. Banks getting trashed again in here. The Goldman Sachs of the world. You had transports, another problematic, down about seven points in here. Luckily, they had a late recovery. Gold down fractionally, silver up just a bit. And you had the uh, gold stocks down just a bit in here. Bonds up all of eight. You had crude oil up 45 in here, finally having a halfway decent day. And you had the dollar doing much of nothing. Advanced decline, only up about 100. They all day were up when the market was up, but their slope was the same as the ESs. So when the ESs started selling off, you also said, had on the right, you had the advanced decline also having the same kind of slope on the way down as you see here. Almost perfect in here. Interesting in there. Slight rally on the close. The advanced decline rallied on the close. You got the UVXY down 75 in here. You had the foreign markets up just fractionally. So what's the moral of the story in here? ESs are at an important level. The idea is on a daily chart and an hourly, you have this nice little bear flag in here, but they held. Why did they hold? Every weekend I publish a simpler stocks, a uh, stock twitch sentiment table. I'm not gonna show you the whole table, but I'll show you that, see, I do this every weekend. Stock twitch sentiment table. The idea in here is the stock twitch sentiment, the bullish sentiment, fell like a rock today. I'm going to go put up stock twits up here, and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. Go put up stock twits. Yep, I have almost 42,000 followers. And go put in the, uh, the SPX today. And look at this sentiment, 64% bearish. What's more amazing is I look at this all the time. And this morning, it was 51% bullish. The amount of bulls fell like a rock today, meaning to me that too many people were leaning short. That's what made me not get short at the bottom down here when everybody thought it was Armageddon. So for now, on the simpler stock side, we're going to talk about what the implications are next week. To let you know, we still have the $7.30 day trial Includes me for at least an hour in the morning, whether you like it or not. Premium videos, much more in depth than what you're hearing now. Learning videos. I do a bunch of learning videos that then go into here that a lot of other places charge $99. They're anywhere from 15 minutes to an hour and interactive as if it was a chat room. And then they go into here. Look how many we've had. All with your subscription. So I hope you've enjoyed this uh, video. Have a great weekend, and I will talk to you on Monday.